Isn't it great to deliver all these presents? Uh oh, I might be getting sick. Uh huh? What was that? Oh no! Look! Uh oh no! Oh, Morphle! Morph into a rocket! Thank you, Mila and Morpho. Santa! What happened, Santa? My Santa magic does some weird things when I'm sneezing. <laughs> and I think I'm getting sick. Uh -oh. I only need to deliver a couple more presents. Could you help me? Of course. Morpho, Morpho. Into a sleigh. Great. Let's go. Oh, uh, this present needs to go into that chimney. And this one needs to go into that one. Oh, no. Thanks, Morphle. Thank you so much for all your help. <laughs> no problem. You can sleep here tonight to get better, Santa. <laughs> Thank you, Mila and Morphle. Uh, this is very kind of you. Merry Christmas, Santa. Merry Christmas! You didn't think I forgot about you, did you? Ho, ho, ho! Merry Christmas! <laughs> you were right, Troy. This is pretty funny. I have to admit... <sighs> It's nice to have a break from work and have some fun on the beach. I want the beach all to ourselves. Yeah, then we'd be the beach bandits. Do you have your costume? Let's go. Ice cream. <laughs> I've got yummy ice cream. <laughs> ice cream. Can I have one, too? Of course. Here you go. Ew. This ice cream is really bad. Ugh, I need to wash my mouth. Maybe we shouldn't get ice cream, Morphle. Yeah. <laughs> oh, no. It's Bandit Stein. Uh, I need to stop him. Uh-oh. 
I can't believe I'm a beach guard now. You can't stay on the beach. Why not? Um, because... Because there is a big wave about to hit the beach. Oh, dear. Let's get away. <laughs> also, you can't build sandcastles on Bandit Beach. <laughs> yeah. Bandit Yarn has been working out. <clears throat> but I need to stop them. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> <laughs> Now we only need to scare the last kids away. seen the bandits? <laughs> These bandits? You already caught them. Great! This beach is now the Bandit Beach. Because it has a Bandit Beach jail. <laughs> <laughs> Daddy, Daddy, we're going to go trick or treat. Do you want to come with us? No, sorry, Mila. I'm going to search for the magic pet, Spookler. Spookler? It is said only to appear on Halloween and uses all sorts of crazy magic. That's something I want to see for myself. Sounds cool. I hope you get to see it. Candy! Yes, Morphle, we're going. See you later, Daddy. Bye-bye. Those awesome, scary costumes. Let me see. Ah, uh, ghost! I want my mommy! <laughs> Everybody, this is not a drill. There's a real ghost ship on the loose. Turn off your lights, close your windows, and lock your doors! That sounds pretty serious, Morphle. No candy? Let's go, Morphle. We're not going to let anyone ruin Halloween. Mia! Huh? It's real! Keep up, Pirate Phil! That darn magic pet is not going to get away with our ship. Magic pet? That must be Spookler, the magic pet Daddy was talking about. Morph into a spider and follow them. Hey, look at me. I can fly. Of course you can. You're a ghost. A ghost! 
<laughs> this is great. No wall is gonna stop us now from getting all the treasure in the world. <laughs> Come, Pirate Phil. Daddy said Spookler's magic will only last one night. Do you want to be a ghost for one night too, Morphle? <laughs> Anything, how are we going to collect candy? No candy? Let's ask Daddy if he wants to help us. Oh, Spookler. Oh, everything is so quiet. Daddy! Whoa! Ghost! Ghost! No, Ghost! Morpho! We saw Spookler, Daddy, and he turned us into ghosts for one Whoa. night. Oh, wow. That is pretty amazing. But now we can't hold anything. So will you help us collect candy? <laughs> okay, Mila. Adventures, but something's wrong. Hmm, let's have a look. Every time we're about to get the treasure, this happens. Oh, I see what the problem is. It seems to have a bug. What's a bug? A bug is a small mistake in the game that prevents you from finishing this level. I know how to fix it. <laughs> you and Morphle have to go inside the game and defeat the bug. If you go stand over, let's see, uh, here, I'll make sure you end up in the game. Good luck. I think we need to go over there. That's where the end of the level is. the level. Thank you so much for taking care of these scary animals while the zoo is under construction. No problem at all, Kenneth. They're not so scary once you get to know them. Morphle, morph into a truck. Morphle, 
see? They already feel at home. Have they gone completely mad, Barky? You can't keep scary animals in a backyard. They're far too dangerous. I guess they're going to have to learn it the hard way. What's going on here? Why are you fighting? All right then. a good idea to bring the animals here, Daddy. Uh, maybe you're right. If they behave bad again, we'll have to bring them back to Zookeeper Kenneth. Let's give them some food. Maybe they'll calm down. <laughs> what are you going to do, silly animals? No, no, help! Barky, wait for me, Barky! Ah! Oh no! We have to save him, Morphle! Morph into a helicopter! Okay, morph into a truck with a cage, Morphle. Animals, why do you keep doing bad things? Because they're very bad animals. Victory is mine. Hey, stop it. Have you been teasing them all this time? So what? They're scary animals. Watch out, dudes! Sharks in the water! Morphle, we have to tell those sharks that they shouldn't scare people. Morph into a shark. What are they doing? Whoa! Whoa! Good job, Morphle. But look, those sharks are still scaring away people. We need to help him, Morphle. Robot sharks? We need 
to go, Morpho. By now, the robot sharks must have scared away all the people from the beach. <laughs> Yeah, so now we can steal all of their towels. I can't believe Professor Rashid fell for it. The idea that we actually wanted these robots in order to research sharks. And that he made them in exchange for just one egg sandwich. <laughs> Speaking of which, where are our robot sharks? <gasps> Look out, Morpho! Not those two again. Morpho, become a big shark too. <laughs> You're no match for our robot. Let's get him, Yorn. Now more flags, Morpho. Oh, 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 oh! We need to get out of here. Look, Stein, our robot sharks have come to save us. Those are not robot sharks, Yorn. Those are real sharks. Help! Help! learned an important lesson today. Yeah, real sharks are dangerous. So we shouldn't scare people while dressed like sharks? Exactly. How about a little story before bed? Yay, story time! Once upon a time in a kingdom far away lived a brave king and his beautiful daughter. But then a giant climbed the tower to her bedroom window and kidnapped the princess. Boring. What? Why doesn't the giant kidnap the king for once? But who's going to save the king then? The princess, of course. Morpho. And Morpho. Well, fine. The giant kidnapped the king and ran off with him. Help! Oh, princess, save me! <sighs> oh, no! We need to stop that giant! Morpho, morph into a suit of armor! Perfect! Now you can save the king. No, we need a sword first! Magic sword! Yeah! A magic sword! But the giant is getting away! What's so magical about it? It can defeat any monster by making a rainbow, so they will be happy. What? Ooh! Oh! We're sorry, everyone. We were stealing your stuff while you were busy. Until we saw this pretty rainbow. We don't want to be bad anymore. Oh, all right. But how will you find the king now? The giant is long gone. Hmm. You could ask the dragon. Yeah, the dragon should know. No, you have to find the giant. This story is about a giant. Take my horse to visit the dragon. Well, thank you very much. Oh, 
fine. Go to the dragon! But do you even know where the dragon lives? Well, over there, of course. Are you sure you want to go in? It sounds s s scary. The princess couldn't see anything. It was way too dark in the dragon's cave. Hello? So she decided to go out and find the giant. But first, the princess's magic sword lit up the cave. Okay, okay, nice trick. So you probably want to know where the giant lives? You should go to the mountain next door. Really? The mountain where the witch lives? So we visit her first? Okay. Go to witch! Oh no. Here's the witch. Go ask her. Well, hello there. Hello, Mrs. Witch. We are looking for the giant. Can you help us find him? Yes, I definitely know where he lives. Take a few steps back, my dear. A little more, please. <laughs> Yes, the giant's castle. And there's the giant. He is so big and scary. You need to save me, princess. But you'll have to defeat me first. And then the princess made the prettiest rainbow anybody had ever seen and turned the giant from bad to good. What? And they had a tea party to celebrate. Yay, I'm saved. <sighs> I guess with that, the story is done. <sighs> that was the best story ever, Daddy. You really think so? Can you tell us another story? Well, I can tell you another one tomorrow, but now it's time to sleep. In your sleep, you will be able to dream up any story you like. Come, Morpho. Let's go on a great adventure. <sighs> No! Give that back! You'd have to catch this first, old man! <laughs> oh, Mila, Morphle, the bandits have stolen my time racer! Aha! So that's what this is! Let's go do some crime through time! <laughs> yeah. Oh, no! Morph into a time racer, too, Morphle! to crime in a different time style. Hold it. But the bandits. No buts, my lady. I am Knight Petarian Frost, and you are trespassing in my medieval village. Oh no! Morph into a dragon, Morphle! Just you wait, you dragon. I'm going to get my real sword.
Right over, Princess! Are you all right, my little princess? Yes, dear father. Thanks to these curious travelers. Uh, Mila? Me? No. I'm Princess Leela. And this is Sir Father. I'm Mila. And this is Morpho. Morpho. A pleasure to meet you both. Say, do you perhaps know where those awful bandits have taken our treasure? Hmm. I might. Morpho, morph back into a big time racer. That's right. You better run. No dragons in my city, uh, village. <laughs> We're rich, Stein. Yes. Maybe we can stop stealing now. No! <laughs> Hand over that treasure, you scoundrels! Oh, let's go, Yon! Your luck has run out! Quickly, the other car! Oh, not cool! You made this contraption, good sir? Are you a wizard? Oh, <laughs> well, no. I'm a scientist. How curious. Well, if you have a moment. Sir Father seems to thoroughly enjoy it here. Well, you are welcome to visit anytime, whenever you want. Fruits of the earth by sea, which is, of course, the speed of light. You're right. Oh, I think we will. That is visible only by three known irrational cofactorials. 